Hey everybody, Nell Bloom here. Welcome back to my channel for some more Horizon Forbidden West. And right now we are back at this uh, water station and we finally got our breeding mask last episode. So we're about to head in down there. Let's dive and see what's up. And I'm waiting to explore this place. Oh boy, we cannot drown anymore. This is so sweet. All right, what is this glow down here? What? What? All right, you know what? I, I think that we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to get rid of this water. Is that fire gleam or something? Ah, no, that's a hologram. All right, what about going over here then? There's a lot of holograms. Oh boy, oh, oh, oh right. Um I guess we got to find a way over here. Good thing is that we cannot even drown, which is amazing. I can I can dive all I want now. Oh shit. Um Okay, what now? Do we go up or do we go down? I think we have to go down. Yeah, we have to go down here. Oh, shit. What is that? Damn, there's so many signals all around me. Look at this. Like we have a sonar system. You know what? Can I actually go? Shit, let's hope that dude doesn't see me because I do not want to get eaten. Okay, so what now? Can we actually pass through here? Looks like there's a strong freaking current and I cannot pass. Yeah, this dude is making such a strong ass current. I don't think that I'm actually able. Yeah, I won't make it to the door before the machine spots me. Yeah, alright, so what now then? Maybe we can go down there. There should be a way to bait this machine into getting away from that spot. What if I go down here? Activate? Okay, let's see what happens. All right, so uh, what's next? Where do we go? Do we follow the signals, or do we do we actually go here first? All right, so I guess we gotta sneak around because uh, if the machine spot me, I have no way to fight back. Alo, get in. There must be a whole network of these tunnels down here. Water lines for an entire city. Damn, did I actually mention that I hate water levels so much? 
bring out brings out a lot of anxiety anxiety in me god damn it i can't reach the ledge from here there is something i can climb to get out all right i see fire gleam on the other side um Medicinal berry. Uh, uh, okay, I guess we gotta keep diving down here, maybe. Or, nope. You gotta find something to climb onto. We don't really see a thing that we can actually grab onto. There's no marker. Maybe there's another spot that we can actually climb onto. Yeah, this door doesn't seem to budge. What if I dive down here and go up here? There we go. All right, there's a ladder. Cool. Finally, we're getting somewhere. Can I call my mount? <laughs> mount cannot enter this location, of course. <laughs> Imagine it uh, comes uh, storming through the walls. Open the valve. Let's see what happens. One node down. Better swim back up and find the access point for the second node. Then we gotta swim back up. Come on. All right. What's in here, though? Oh, there's a box. The eye and a watch and a necklace. Anything else? Nah, no, doesn't seem like it. Alright. Let's get going. What is that? Alright, uh, where was the way up? Over here for the pipe, maybe? I think so. God damn it, there's a freaking gator here. No, we gotta go fast. I think I see it down there, but there's a freaking gator. Yeah, I see that pipe. Alright, uh, that little bugger's scurrying off. Cool, alright, now's our chance. Let's go. Oh shit, Aloy! What the hell? She's doing some strange acrobatics underwater over here. Alright. What do we got here? That door's closed. Yep, looks like a ladder over here. Let's get it. Alright. Where's that valve? Oh, document. Oh shit, okay, I gotta, gotta make a jump over here. Uh, can I make it? Yes! Woo! That was close. Is it stuck? Maybe that debris is weighing it down. What debris? Oh. Alright, Gleam. Alright, never mind. Let's get rid of this real quick. All right, this should do it. <laughs> there we go. Time's all right. Now we just need to activate the emergency to the station. Return to the sunken city. That's her mission right now. All right. Hopefully we can uh, make it there in one piece without getting eaten. Is that fishes? A 
shit, they almost saw me. This is not good. Oh my god, I, I am under heavy surveillance over here. They might spot me. Alright. That might be the maintenance station. We gotta be careful of that gator. Gonna get in through here, maybe. Wow, looks like I can actually get in. God damn! Oh my god! Yes, green shine. All right, we're in. I just gotta find a console to activate the emergency switch. You know what? I'm getting all of the loot first. I don't care. Loot is the most important thing. Take everything, yes. I'm long ass corridor over here. Good thing it's not a maze. Can I open this? Okay, I think what that uh, this is our spot. There should be a console here. There. I'm gonna drive this place out. Oh boy, okay, here we go. <clears throat> Time to fight the big one. Alright, so I guess that mask sure is handy. That did it. <laughs> okay. Now I can deal with that machine guarding the door on the other end of the dome. And once I get past it, I can get to what's waiting on the other side of the door. Alright, so is there anything else here? Ah, oh, let me just just my headset real quick. Alright, now I can continue. Um Shit. I guess we got to do some more swimming. Well, that sucks. Okay. Oh my god. This looks like a completely different place now. Alright, so, oh, damn, there's so much stuff uncovered now. A lot of data points and stuff. Do we explore first, or do we head for the main area? I kind of want to fight that big monster. But everything looks so damn cool! Alright, yeah, there's freaking gators everywhere, though. I could sneak by them. Alright, can we make this asshole turn around so we can just backstab him? Oops. Well, I guess that didn't work. Well, here you go. Is the gator coming? Oh my god, the gator's coming! Shit! Alright, we gotta handle this bad boy. God damn it, gator! All 
Alright, this might be a pain in the ass to deal with. Ow, come on. How did that hit me? Oof. And bonk. Finally, alright, let's hit his face. God damn it, Gator! Seriously? How do they always move at the last second? Come on. Can I knock this canister off at least? Ugh. Alright, you know what? Wow, I think we actually managed to knock it off. There we go, finally. Alright. I need to find medicinal herbs. Okay, all right. Let's let's go fight that big one now. I, I'm kind of curious to see what's up with the big one. Where is it? Oh boy, there's a lot of stuff here though. Looks like there's more machines up there. Alright, let's see. I think this is the main area that Nessie is at. Poseidon is through there. But where did that machine go? Aloy! It's a miracle! Oh, oh. oh get back! Is this you? Did you lower the waters? Yeah, but there's a new problem. That thing's in our way. Wow. Yeah, it's gonna be difficult to get the embers with that around. As the scrappy band of adventurers beheld the beast, they knew what they had to do. What? Are you crazy? Hush now. She saved our death. Okay, then. Stay up here and start firing when I engage. Oh boy, alright. Time to fight this bad boy. And what is that huge ass disc on his back? Oof. Alright. You know what? I have to scan it first. That big ass disc is gonna be my first target. Most definitely. Ow! Holy crap! That hurt so much. Damn it! Oh my god! It's a giant ass turtle or something. It might be the Loch Ness Monster, I do not know. 208 damage with the volley, not bad. Oof, okay, that, that should have been a dodge. Okay, no idea how that hit me, but alright. Gotta start hitting that disc. Oh my god, it's spinning. Yo, it's shooting water everywhere. What's going on? Holy crap, Aloy, we gotta run. Oh my god, I'm in the water. 
Hello, I am under the water. I am under the water. Alright, I think it finally stopped spinning. God damn it, what's hitting me? Damn, that's a long ass range. Can we finally knock that disc off? God damn. Alright. It should be pretty mad now. Oh boy, what? Oh my god, I wasn't expecting that. That's crazy. Oof, alright, you know what? Um, I'm gonna finish you off right now, buddy. Oh my god, not like this though. I'm hitting it in the lung. Out of stamina, what gives? Alright, not a good idea to melee it, I guess. Alright, I got it. That was pretty easy. Aloy! <laughs> you did it! Is there anything else here? Maybe something fell off from the disc? Alright, let's see if there's any other loot down there. Yeah, I think that's parts of the disc. Idol disc. Wow, gave nothing. Alright, uh, let's get back to the crew then. What up? You guys alright? More than alright. This. You. We did it! <laughs> all the embers we could ever want, and it's all thanks to you. Very. Uh, heartwarming. But maybe we can just. You know. Grab what we came here for and get out before any more of those things decide to show up. Now, now, shard counter. Nothing wrong with a little reprim. Though we should probably let our flame-haired friend get going. I believe she has business down here, does she not? Right, of course. You need any help? I can handle it from here. Very well. Well, we'll start taking some of the embers upstairs. Holler if you need us. All right, let me do the honors in opening the door first. Where is that door at? Is, is that it? I think it's over here. It's open now. Yeah, that should be it. Oh, is there anything down there? Hmm, I don't think so. All right, let's go. Let me grab this first. Back to full medicinal. So, do we go here? What is that? That's a working server. Wow, alright. Okay. Poseidon should be hiding in some kind of processor. I need to find a console to gain access to it. There. All right, I see something up there. What is that, though? Valuables box. We got another a Rolex. I'm here to bring you home, Poseidon. To Gaia. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Restoring the science subordinate function to original code. Alright, we got our ether. Let's head on out. Hopefully there's no far zenith waiting for me outside. Triggered a restart of the city's power system. Huh. 
What does that mean? Oh my god. Wow, okay. That looks even cooler now. Damn, I love this place so much. I would love to come back here and explore this later. I have no idea where I'm going, but I'm thinking that this is the right way to exit from. Looks like there's a door here. Alright, you know what? Let me check this spot out real quick. There might be something cool hiding here. Maybe not. Maybe this is just the way to head out. Looks like it. Oh. What? I got stuck in something. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna head here. Okay, so what's next? Do we like... How do we exit? Kind of confusing right now. Maybe if I jump this spot. Hmm. Alright, so let's see. Where can we actually climb on? Is there anything climbable over here? That looks like a ladder. Alright, so I guess that this is the way out. Where's that ladder at? Oh, there it is. Okay, it was right in front of me the whole time. What? Aloy! What the hell? I just tried to dash on the ladder and she jumped onto the freaking uh, pole caster thing. Oh my god. She does some real shenanigans sometimes. Alright, data point. Gimme. Give Gimme give the loot. Damn, there's so many data points here. All right. Merlin must have built this before the place flooded. Must have work. Be nice not to have to climb back up. There we go. It's good to have some assistance. Okay, so, uh, do I just drop here for the hole? Maybe. Yeah, there's nothing down here. Whatever she did, she must have powered up the whole city. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, oh show my old Gramps always wanted. There's another. <laughs> His dream realized, his old Gramps' legacy ensured, our hero beheld the sea of desert lights and wept at his good fortune. When I saw the Embers as a child, I never dreamed they could be like this. Thank you, Aloy. Well, did you find what you were looking for? I did. And now I have to move on. Oh. Oh. C come back when you can. I got big plans for this place. I thought you wanted to put on shows with the Embers back in the claim. Oh, no. This is the show. Oh, can you imagine? Folks from all over the land coming to take it all in. Plus, some food and a nice place to stay. So basically Vegas without the drugs. Not to mention her. Variety of entertainment venues. Yeah, don't forget, games of chance. Plenty of shards to be had there for certain. <laughs> yep, just like Vegas. Dream, huh? I am. Um, I hope you make it happen. Goodbye, gentlemen. This delve is 
a story for the ages. All thanks to you. All right, I think we need to head back to Gaia now. Who's gonna stay? Maybe I should come back and check on them later. For now, I need to get Poseidon back to Gaia. But I might want to find that Osiron camp first. See if Talana made it. And with my new diving mask, I can swim as deep as I need to. Like at those deep water sites I found earlier. Deep water sites? Um, okay, whatever. What is that? Roll of the Brack Savage. Okay, that is a side quest. Time to head back to base. Going to talk to Gaia, return Poseidon, see what's our next move over here. What? Oh my god, there's another rumor waiting for me. Alright, let's grab it. Hello, Prodigy. Choosing the right rations can be just as important to your chance of survival as choosing the right weapons. If you want food that'll save your life out in the wilds, go northwest to Salt Bite. The cook there, Pintala, she'll whip up a meal for anyone who needs it, to knock or not. I'll make sure to pay her a visit if I'm out that way. Oh, all right. Got a new errand. Stay alert, soldier. You shouldn't miss. Uh, how do we enter base? I I need to find a quicker way to enter base. This is kind of annoying, to be honest. So, if I follow the map up here... So, do I just follow the path? I think I have to follow the path. So, there should be a door he somewhere on here. Okay, where's the goddamn door? What? This is so confusing. There's no door. Hello? Maybe it's up here. Is it up here? Yeah, there we go. There's the door. Damn. Hello, home base. I am back. So the old ones painted their faces with something called makeup. Like the car chip. Why? Yeah, beats me. Oh my god. <laughs> I could like sit there and uh, uh, watch their conversations for like 20 minutes. I wouldn't get bored. They're, they're so entertaining. I see you have recovered Poseidon. Yep. There we go. Now you have fish. Oh, all right. Let's right hear it out. Aloy, I have managed to unlock additional rooms within the facility. Got it. Oh boy, we got more rooms. Uh, where's Beta at? Hello. Oh, that's machine strike. Beta. Where is she? Is she down there in the server room again? Yeah, she's still down here. found that recording from the data on your focus. She's been watching it a lot. I think it helps calm her. You know, I used to watch this a lot too. Whenever I wanted to take my mind off things. Daddy sure does love his I mean, she's look she looks like she's in a freaking trance or something. While you were gone, I came down here to check on her. Then we started talking. Right, Beta? Then we smoked some weed. About how to capture Hephaestus. They're studying the data Gaia gave her. But we started talking about some other stuff. You know, just getting to know each other, right? And then she told me that one of the Zeniths might be different from the others. Tilda. You saw her at the Hades Proving Lab. Go on. On the way to Earth, 
The Zeniths never showed their faces. My servitor caretaker referred to them as my benefactors and promised I'd meet them someday when I had learned enough. And then, one day, a data channel opened in my training interface. In it, Tilda was waiting for me in a virtual replica of a house on a cliff. Okay. The ocean. It was beautiful. She showed me paintings, books, media files. Porn. They're in secret many times. But a few months later, it stopped. Can you tell us why, Beta? I found some data about Tilda at the Hades Proving Lab. I think she was a liaison between Far Zenith and Zero Dawn. She knew Elizabeth Sobek, that's for sure. Maybe that's why she reached out to you? So Tilda set up a secret virtual space where she could talk to you, a house on a cliff. Then later, she cut you off. But other than the fact that Tilda knew Elizabeth, you don't know why she did those things? I don't, okay? I thought of every possible reason that would make her leave, but whatever I did wrong, I don't know what it is. When I finally met the others, she ignored me. I acted like the data channel never existed. Damn, all right. Chill the hell out. Wow. Tilda's Someone's in a bad mood. Help us defeat them. Okay. Let's leave it at that then. Damn. Every interaction with her is kind of annoying, to be honest. She's kind of getting on my nerves. Okay. <laughs> that was a bug. But she is tough to take. I'm out there in the wilds, risking my life every day, and all she can do is hide in there and tell us how hopeless it all is. I'm sorry, she's had a rough time, but she is really not helping right now. Now we gotta slap her around a little bit. You always seem to be on top of everything, so I sometimes forget about what you've been through. I mean, it wasn't that long ago you were so banged up you couldn't even walk. About that. When I pulled you out of the water back near the proving lab, you were muttering Rost's name. You never talk about him, but he raised you, trained you. You must miss him a lot. Of course we do miss him. Rost was awesome. I to think about that now. I need to get back out there. Okay. I'll keep working with Beta. Gaia says she knows a lot about Zero Dawn. And maybe she just needs some time to adjust, and then she can help us with Hephaestus. Sure. But I won't hold my breath. Alright, so what's our next objective over here? Go to Dimitri... Dimitri's co coordinates. Demeter. All right, Mr. Demeter, uh, we're going to hit you next, but this is going to be it for this episode. If you're enjoying the series, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. Of course, if you haven't already, leave a like to support the channel and I'll see you real soon with a brand new one.